Howdy folks, this is Jared of Flutie Lake Homestead. Today me and Finley is going to be planting our potatoes. So we're going to show you here uh, how we how we plant them. And uh, it's super simple. And uh, we've got quite a few to plant this year. So uh, come along and we'll get them in the ground. Okay, here's my little tater patch. It's long and narrow. It's only about, uh, about 15 feet wide. But it is long. It's probably 150 feet, 100 feet. Probably at least 100 feet. Go some uh, right down yonder. Comes all the way around here and goes up that little creek bed there. So I can get uh, three rows on this end and two rows on the narrow end. So we're gonna, first thing we're gonna do is lay off our rows. And I lay them off uh, probably about four inches deep. And uh, I'm gonna use my little push plow here. That's what I'm going to lay them off with. So I'm going to get started and lay them off, and I'll show you how we uh, go about planting them. Eventually. Okay, the next thing we're going to do now that we've got our uh, three rows dug, you can see, dug all the way down through there. Um, I'm going to take and put down triple 12 fertilize right in the bottom of the row. And uh, the way I do it, and if you have a lot of manure and uh, stuff in your soil and really, really rich, you may not have to do this. This is the way I've always done it. I just put this fertilizer right in the bottom of the row. Just by the handful. And then once I do all my rows, I'm gonna take, you can do a, ch a chain works really good with for this too, just to pull a chain through it. But then I flip my hoe on its edge or upside down like this. And I just kind of work at fertilize into the row. Uh, like I say, a chain does really good for this too, to drag a chain to it. But I do that, and then we're ready to plant our taters. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put the rest of this fertilizer down, and then I'll show you what I do next. Oh, do you have to dump it? Oh. How do I do that? C please, can I help you please? No, 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 no. no. I promise I won't eat it. No, it'll get on your head. I don't want it on your head. All right, Mr. Finley is working in that fertilizer. Tell him hi, Finn. Hi. Show me a nice little hole right there. That's old, old, old. Look how wore out it is. One of my grandpas gave me this was his uh, grandmother's. She was a little short lady, so that's why it's got that little short handle. And uh, she really worked it to death. He's doing a good job. Yeah, you got to work that fertilizer into the ground, and uh, I'm sure there's other ways you can fertilize them. Uh, this is just the way I've always been taught to do it. <coughs> Am I doing good? Yep. Don't miss none. No. Nope. Okay, we're getting ready to plant our potatoes now. And uh, we're going to plant all last oh, year's potatoes. That's okay, Finn. And uh, 
I've got a bushel basket full of the good ones that was left over from my potatoes. And then Lakin's uncle Dallas gave me these two uh, little buckets of potatoes that he had grew. So we're going to plant these first. And I have not cut these. Normally I cut them, but I'm out of time and they got to go in the ground. And we're going to plant them as is and see how yeah. they do compared to my cut yeah. potatoes. Yeah. So Mr. Finley's going to plant a row. And I'm going to plant a row. Yeah. And uh, we're going to, I'm going to show Finley how to do it. This is your first time planting potatoes, right, Ben? Yeah. Is there three rows? Yep, there's three. All right, now watch me. Wait, where's the three rows? I space my heels potatoes about a foot apart. So I'll put one in, and normally I'm walking, and I'll uh, step on this one, plant this one, then I'll step on this one, and plant the next one. Wait. You see how far apart them are, Finn? Like, yeah, yep. Step on them Watch this. Ah. I step on it and I drop another. Then I'll step on it and I'll drop another one. Okay. Can you do that? Yeah, Alright, let's see you do oh, it. That's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. Let's get over here where we can see you. But oh, nope, too close. Almost. See your boot? You want to be able to get your boot in between them. Yep, there you go. Now, plant it. No, you don't have to cover it yet. We'll come back and cover it. All right, now, here's your another. Put you another one. Yep, that looks... No, just step on it. There you go. There you go. Perfect. All right. Can you catch it? On it. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start planting mine now. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Let me catch up, and then I'll bring the bucket. Okay. Okay, me and Finn have the, all these potatoes planted. You can see them laying here in the rows. Now we're going to take our hoes and just cover them up really good. Yeah. And then uh, we still have about half a bushel, so we're going to go to another garden and plant the rest of them. But we're going to get all these covered up now. Really good. Okay. Yeah, throw that rock out of there. All right, Finn, let's cover them up. All right, cover them up deeper than that. Rake all the dirt over on them good. Okay. Yeah, I'll come behind you and help you. I don't need help. Well, you got to cover them all up. You're missing a few. Sorry. That's okay. I'll move. Okay, push it or pull it. Either way you want to do it. Push and then pull the other side. <laughs> Whatever works. Alrighty, we're going to cover these up.
Okay, we've got them all planted and covered up and uh, supposed to rain tomorrow. So they should start coming up here in the next few weeks. So uh, now uh, we'll just let them come up good. And uh, once they start coming up and uh, they get about six inches tall, I will take and uh, put a hill of dirt over them. And I'll do that two times. And then uh, that's all the hill I put. I'll hill them twice. And um, I might be able to get my gravely in here. Uh, I think I can get it between these rows. And uh, sometimes I can heal them up good with the gravely with the rotary plow. So we'll see. If not, I'll use a little turning blade on the push plow. But uh, that's all we're going to do for them. Uh, I'll probably go in here at about three different places and put me a little heel of uh, like butternut squash or something just to let them share the space. So I'll do that and they're ready to go. So we appreciate y'all watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and we hope you have a very blessed day. Show them these pretty flowers you found, Finn. Them for your mommy? Yeah. 